Good morning and welcome to lesson 14 of unit two. We're actually in section two now of unit two. For lesson 14, we're looking at websites for a purpose. There are many purposes to a website and to various websites, and we're going to be taking a look at those. Today's question of the day, what are the different reasons people make websites? We're going to explore some of those different reasons in this lesson. You're going to brainstorm various reasons why you visit websites and investigate sample websites that have been created to address a particular problem. This goes along with activity guide U2L14, where you choose a couple of websites, why talk about why people would visit them and discuss why the website was made. Um, and then you give three problems you might like to address with a specific website. <clears throat> so, honestly, why do people make websites? Well, you might think they make them to make money, but honestly, um, it starts a little bit deeper than that. Uh, let's take a look at, say, Amazon. Okay, you might think, why do people visit? To buy pretty much anything. Okay. Um, to check prices, to um, compare items, to browse. They just go there for fun, see what's out there. They might visit it to sell stuff. Okay. There are several reasons. Why was it made? Why was Amazon made? You know, to sell, sell books. That's originally why it was made. And then it expanded to help make even more money. Um, I remember buying just books from there way back in the early 2000s. Um, so that's one example. Um, there, we're going to be taking a look at some websites and um, as we do so, you'll think that they're kind of hokey, but that's okay. It's all about what we're doing here. So let's take a look at continue. I'm going to turn off my picture. Okay, problem solving websites. Here are some websites that were created to solve a problem. You're going to choose two of them and use them to complete the activity guide. Okay, so. We won't have to use Amazon. We'll actually be doing something else. But uh, let's get back to there. So save our parks. After their last meeting, the state government has decided they will be putting shutting down parks across the state in order to build a new mall complexes on the land instead. Well, that sounds like a pretty highly um, contentious idea. So here's what people have to say. Okay. And so why would anybody make this website? That's right. They would use this website in order to save parks, get information out there, help people understand that parks are too important to get rid of. And People would visit this to and be informed um, to learn more about the parks and to ensure that terrible ideas are not followed through with. So, conserve our water. Okay, you may not know it, but water conservation become a bigger and bigger issue in the world. Click around the site to learn more. So once again, all information what this is about, what's happening, and how we can help. Okay, then there's more websites to uh, some more resources to look at. Okay, notice how both of these websites we've looked at so far have all of their links on all of their pages. Good stuff. All right, basketball club. Welcome to basketball club webpage. 
We're an award-winning club that looks for new players every year. Feel free to look around the page, but if you want to learn more, check the About Us page. How to join. Okay, all of these links are on the same page again. Club rules. There's a schedule. So, once again, all of the links are on the same page. Makes it easy to navigate. So, this is to get information out there about Basketball Club. And then we have Mosquitoes. Fun facts. All right, this is a, why do we need mosquitoes? Okay, kind of takes a look at why, seriously, we need America's second, or the world's second worst bug. Um, the most deadly for sure because of the diseases it spreads. But that is lesson 14. Um, take a look at that, make sure that you explain why we'll go back to the name of the website why people would visit it and why it was made and you might you're going to find some problems that you might address with one of them um, feel free to take a look at that and explain why you might address uh, some of those problems and what those problems are so enjoy this and um, if you have any questions let me know click like if you like this video, probably you won't even use it because it's a pretty self-explanatory video, to be honest. Anyway, thanks and have a wonderful, wonderful day.